Thanks for stopping by. Today we're going to talk about how to find slope from an, e from an equation, uh, specifically when given in slope-intercept form. So the equation of a line is y equals mx plus b. You've probably seen this or heard of this. Um, this is called slope-intercept form. And this is the form the equation needs to be in to find the slope. So in this equation, um, y is a y value, x is an x value, but m, this is what we want. This is the slope. So if the equation is given in slope-intercept form, the slope is the value in m's place. So let's look at an example. If you're given y equals negative 1 half x plus 2, this value, this is in front of the x, right? This is your m, so this would be your slope. So your slope equals negative 1 half. If we look at another example, say you're given y equals 2x minus 8, Again, your slope is what's in the place of m. So here, your slope is 2. But what if the equation's not given in slope-intercept form? Well, you have to get it into slope-intercept form. So let's look at how to do that. So oftentimes, an equation will be given in standard form. For example, 3x plus 2y equals 6. This is an equation in standard form. So we need to get this into slope-intercept. We're going to minus 3x from both sides. It'll give us 2y equals negative 3x plus 6. We need to get rid of this 2 because we need y by itself. So we divide both sides by 2. This gives us our slope-intercept form of y equals negative 3 half x plus 3. So our slope is right here, right? That's the m value. So slope for this one equals negative 3 halves. Hopefully that helps. If you have any questions, put them in the comments. Uh, let me know what videos you want to see. Check out the free worksheet in the description. And if this video is helpful, give it a like. Thanks.